Coastal GX. We made it back to the East Cut as you can see. Very exciting. Son, come over here. <laughs> Somebody accompanied me. I got Robbie over here and I'll show you some video. We got three point slow out here, a bunch of Toyota guys, and uh, we even have uh, some GX, yeah, some GX people that made it down here. One of them is all the way is coming all the way from San Antonio. Mike, I'll show you his rig in a little while. Let me tell you what we're about to do. We're gonna about, about to cast out over here. We took the morning just to camp out, take care of that. I'm kind of proud. The first, first cast, and I've got three of these things, man. The biggest ones I've ever caught just when the first cast. So we're gonna chop these up, cut them up, and see if uh, we can catch anything back here. What do you think of the turnout, man? It's great. Well, there's still there's some people on the way because yeah, some people didn't want to be here like till the evening. So, so yeah, it's I know you said there's already some guys driving up, right? Uh, Ozzy takes Jake that hooking up Barner and them. I yeah, there's, there's some there's some guys with like brand new foreigners that I know from Instagram, and I know they they said they're gonna be here. So I'm pretty sure that's them on their way. Reinforcements are coming with uh, drinks, ice. You know. Yeah, we're just getting started. Everything we need. We're just getting started. Hey man, is this one of the better turnouts? You said? <laughs> this is the most we've ever had, honestly. Like us, like doing something. As, yeah. If everyone camps out, then I think so because yeah. there's there's usually big turnouts where everyone drives yeah. out here. But as far as camping out, they'll leave, yeah. there'll, there'll be like less vehicles, you know. Oh, but it's it's not safe to drive back at night. Like yeah, uh, really, yeah. we learned that the hard yeah. way. Yeah, what hard way? We had a friend. Who oh, his yeah, organ trunk got ripped out. He hit a metal pipe that was sticking on the ground. Yeah, so I was I was planning on leaving tonight, but you're not leaving anymore, dude. You're not leaving. I wouldn't trust that truck going back. <laughs> We're gonna put <laughs> your tires all the way. So not anymore. Leave. It's already uh, 1 30. It's 1 30 in the afternoon, and uh, no bites. It's been very slow for everyone out here. Um, however, we've had a great time. Met a lot of people. People that were following the channel, I didn't even know about, and uh, that really warms my heart. You know, it's, this is uh, my one year anniversary at Coastal GX. We've been doing this for a year now, and um, we had a very good turnout. I haven't gotten an exact count, but I did fly the drone and uh, to try to get a mas o menos as to how many people were out here. The folks are out here with their families. Uh, everybody's having a good time. Some of them decided to come out here. They grabbed their trash bags, went out, picked up some uh, uh, some trash out here. Everybody is being so nice and so friendly. Uh, a lot of folks are trying their luck with, uh, you know, trying to cast out and trying to fish. Other people just came out here, like this gentleman over here. He came out with his family, here with his boy right here. He's got a beautiful setup, and we'll, we'll go and talk to him in a little bit. 
I'm so happy, I'm so proud. I can't believe it's been a year already, you know, since Samantha, Robbie and I, you know, came out here to try our luck at camping and uh, to learn that new experience. We have some other young men out here that also decided uh, to join us and man, uh, it, it's been great meeting these people. Caught a couple of rays this morning and then we got a while ago a huge ray, maybe about, what was it, like 30 inches diameter? About, huge ray. It was top 80 pound braided line. So, it was a big ray. Uh, I hit the dunies by accident. And when I hit the dunies, <laughs> the bag just happened to, you know, just tear apart. And then all the charcoal breakage just spread all over the back of my hatch. I think it's trend in the right direction. Oh, charcoal explosion, bro. That's <laughs> hilarious, man. Pay attention to those details and whatever is bothersome, try to find a solution for it if that that's all that's what I can say and uh, believe me or not if they didn't want to come over here and camp out before they might be able they might want to now that you have a better setup so that's all you got to do don't quit. Don't quit. all right guys everyone has to get at least one uh, bag trash bag and then got to fill it up and bring it back to the trailer I'll put it in the trailer and I'll take it back and the back that way the more keeps the nomad. <laughs> Go! Okay guys, so we didn't just come here to mess around with our toys and fish and stuff like that. We figured we'd come out here, try to collect a little bit of trash. If everybody picks up at least one big bag that would that sure would be nice if you're gonna be out here if you're gonna come out here and enjoy this area we strongly suggest that you do the same thing not just well not just pick up after yourselves because that should be a given but perhaps be able to take another another bag load in honor of this beautiful place that you, we are enjoying and right here you got got the three point slow boys right there <laughs> she's like what are we playing at What do you got here? Oh my God. So an effort was made. It's obvious. You know, it's semi bag. Oh shoot. You know, spread out. No, 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 no. So I think an effort was made, effort Jake, was made. Yeah. to collect some uh, aluminum cans aluminum to go cans. and sell them to get more beer. Pretty much, yeah. <laughs> Easy, uh, it's money though. It's like change on the ground. Yeah, man. Oh no. <laughs> Probably fell off the truck, really. Yeah. <laughs> so much carnage. Oh. Yeah, hey, just be careful in the grass because there is snakes. Snakes! Dude, made in China. Achoo! <laughs> One man's treasure. Ooh. Ooh, that's for steak tonight, baby.
done it before. We'll do it again. Here we go. One year later, and we're still having T-bones. Looking really good. But, that's right, heart attack, man. Gotta add a little bit of a butter. Oh, shoot. All right. All right, my friend, I'm gonna bring that plate over. Serve it on up, brother. After a very, look at this, look at this, guys. Check this, check this out. He's cooking me a steak out here. Boom. My, my wife doesn't even do that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, guys, check this out. Right here, we got our boy, Jonathan, from Three Point Slow. Let's see what he thinks. He's about to uh, dig into that steak. Be honest, bro. Right, super juicy. I got cut off. This guy taking my steak, man. It was, it was just a piece. It's so soft. Right? So soft. That's awesome, bro. Awesome. Perfect. Yeah, that's what we that's what we eat when we get skunked. Coming up in day two of Coastal GX's one year anniversary trip to the East Cut. This is the first time I ever cut one of these, so it's pretty exciting. Thank you for watching. I promise to share many more adventures with you this year. Please consider subscribing to our channel. Your support encourages me to keep uploading content.